the ship provides a plan for the transfer of cargo. The plan includes information about the draft of the ship on arrival, during the transfer, and on completion of cargo. This ensures that under keel clearance is maintained throughout the transfer, and the difference in displacement of the arrival and departure drafts is an indication of the amount of cargo transferred. The ship's transfer plan will include details of the manifolds to be used. The vetting and compatibility process will have ensured that the diameter and disposition of the connections are known before, and this is just documented confirmation. The ship has to be securely moored in place throughout the transfer. The ship and terminal work together to ensure the ship is securely moored and the transfer arms remain within their working envelope. The transfer plan often has details of how the vessel is to be moored. The transfer plan contains details of how the ship and shore communication and emergency shutdown systems will be connected. The transfer plan has details about whether it will be a closed transfer, with a vapor line connected, or a vented transfer. The transfer plan will give the details of every valve and whether is required to be open or shut for the transfer of every grade. The transfer plan gives details of the maximum pressures and flow rates allowed during the transfer. The transfer plan has details of how the ship will ballast or deballast during the transfer.